The island of Phuket is one of the biggest in Thailand, in addition to being one of the most popular. From exploring the city of Phuket to visiting one of the island's exotic markets, join Viewcation as we take a look at the best things to do in Phuket, Thailand. Visit the city of Phuket Phuket is not only the name of the island, but also the name of the island's major city. The city of Phuket is always bustling and filled with plenty of opportunities for tourists to get a taste of Thailand's unique culture. The city is located on the island's southeastern coast and occupies a bay. Visitors to the city will find all the usual things from places to stay and places to eat and even places to get a Thai massage. The architecture of the city will not only be unique to tourists, but also unique compared to the other architecture in Thailand. The buildings in the city of Phuket have some decidedly Chinese and Portuguese inspirations thanks to the influence of immigrants. The most interesting area in the entire city has to be its old town area, which is filled with shops and finely preserved historical buildings. Families visiting the city may enjoy visiting the Phuket Trick Eye Museum, which is an interactive art gallery where visitors can take pictures that make it seem as if they are part of the art on display. There's certainly plenty to do within the confines of the city, but those who truly want to experience what Phuket has to offer will also want to check out the rest of the beautiful and expansive island. Go on a boat tour of the island. One of the best ways to get a taste of all the various seascapes and beaches that the island has to offer is to take a tour of the island on a boat. There are numerous organized tours that tourists can take while visiting Phuket, including some that will take up nearly the entire day. An experienced guide will lead the tour and they'll be able to pass along plenty of knowledge to passengers. Most tours will also include food and refreshments. Go snorkeling in Phuket's beautiful blue waters. Phuket is one of the best places in the world to build up some experience snorkeling. Diving certification courses tend to be a good deal cheaper in Thailand than they are in other parts of the world, which means learning to dive and snorkel can be a bit more affordable than in other beach locations. There's also the fact that the waters in the area are gorgeous, and there's plenty of unique sea life to view. In addition to the seemingly infinite and immensely colorful corals that divers will find themselves around, They'll also get a chance to see creatures like seahorses, sea turtles, and manta rays. The water is always clear and warm. Visit one of the island's beautiful beaches. Even if you aren't going to be going for a dive, there are numerous reasons to visit one of Phuket's gorgeous beaches. The island is filled with them, and the most popular is inarguably Patong Beach. While it's certainly an interesting tourist location, it's always incredibly crowded and offers little opportunity for visitors to relax but its plentiful shops and array of activities will keep tourists entertained. Those looking for a slightly more secluded beach can try Kata Beach, although it will still have plenty of visitors on an average day. It has beautiful white sand and is surrounded by dense hillsides on each side. Those looking for an even quieter beach can head south of Kata Beach to Kata Noi Beach. Visit the Great Buddha of Phuket the Great Buddha of Phuket, which is also known simply as Phuket Big Buddha, is a giant Buddha statue crafted out of white jade marble that sits atop a high summit. The summit itself grants visitors to the statue unprecedented views of Phuket Island, though the giant Buddha statue looming over you will slightly distract from them. The statue is 45 meters high and was built upon the summit in 2004. Hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to Viewcation if you haven't already and stick around for more of the best of Phuket. Pay a visit to the village of Rawai. Those looking to get a taste of more authentic bits of culture may want to head to the village of Rawai, located on Phuket's east coast. The village is home to a tribe that goes by the name of the Moken, though most in the area simply refer to them as sea gypsies. These are people with ancestral ties to Thailand that take great pride in their culture, and they aren't afraid to let tourists get a glimpse of their unique lifestyles. The Mokin are mostly fishermen, and you may even find one willing to take you on a boat tour. If you're visiting the village, one of the best things to do is purchase the catch of the day at one of its seafood markets and take it to a local restaurant to have one of the village's authentic Thai chefs prepare it for you. Visit one of Phuket's stunning temples. There are numerous temples on the island open to tourists, and two of the most notable are Wat Chalong and Wat Phra Tong. Wat Chalong is the largest and most popular of the many temples found within the island of Phuket. It's dedicated to two highly respected monks, and you can see their likenesses recreated with life-size wax models while visiting. While Wat Chalong is the largest and most popular, Wat Pratong gives it a run for its money. 
Wat Pratong is a temple with some unique lore, as legend has it that the broken Buddha statue, which functions as the temple's centerpiece, was long since buried before appearing to a man in his dreams and being dug up. While being dug up, the statue cracked in two, and it remains broken to this day. Many of Thailand's natives still come to these temples to worship, though visitors can come to get a taste of the culture whether they believe the legends or not. Visit Monkey Hill Monkey Hill is the highest hill located within the city of Phuket, and it has lots of monkeys on it. There are said to be 400 macaques living on the hill. There's more to look at than just the monkeys, though, as there's also a shrine at the bottom of the hill that Thai people are known to ask for lucky lottery numbers at. Visit the Gibbon Rehabilitation Center If visiting Monkey Hill sounds like something up your alley, you'd certainly also want to visit the Gibbon Rehabilitation Center. Gibbons are intelligent apes that have sadly become the victims of poachers, and the Gibbon Rehabilitation Center is a sanctuary that works to rescue and rehabilitate gibbons in need. Besides them, there are also some gibbons that live at the center all the time. Visitors will get a chance to interact with these gibbons, offering tourists a wildlife opportunity that can't be beat. Take a walk around Sirinat National Park Those looking to get a taste of some of the most beautiful landscapes can take a walk around Sirinat National Park. The national park was previously known as Nayang National Park and sits on the northwest coast of the island. Much of the park's boundaries are made up of beaches, with these beaches often being a great deal more secluded than any of the other beaches we've mentioned. Visitors there may get a rare chance to see a leatherback turtle come ashore and lay eggs, which happens predominantly from November to February. Visitors should note that it is frowned upon to disturb these eggs, and guards patrol the beaches to ensure no one does. Experience Thai Cuisine at an Exotic Market there are numerous exotic markets strewn all over the island of Phuket, some of them being the outdoor street markets and some of them being contained indoors. Some of the most popular markets to be found are the Banzan Fresh Market and the Phuket Weekend Night Market. The Banzan Fresh Market is an indoor market where visitors can find plenty of food and even souvenirs. Meanwhile, the Phuket Weekend Night Market, which is open only at nights and during the weekends, is one of the best places in all of Phuket to try street food. Now it's time to hear from you. Did we miss any of your favorites in Phuket? Let us know in the comments section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Vucation if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content.